Welcome to another edition of Sermons from a Hat. We have a list of things that relate to our COVID reality that I have a hat in a hat in the room and I selected one before I came outside today. Um, and during this time, I'm going to, in two minutes, preach a sermon. Adela's going to entertain you in the back just in case the sermon drags on. You know, it's for that time when you would normally be falling asleep in church, but here you can be entertained. I haven't exactly figured out how to bring this into the pulpit, but it's okay because we're out of the church right now. Anyway, now our sermon from the hat topic in the next two minutes, we have changes. Good, bad, health. Our, in, our environment. I heard an interesting thing this week about the canal, canals of Venice that you can actually see because usually there was so much um, traffic on them with the gondolas that they were muddy um, waters. And so now since the tourists are not going there, that the, the waters have settled and you can actually see the sea life in there, that there are jellyfish and um, anyway, it's really interesting some of the changes that are happening in the midst of all of this. And when I think about change, I think how much God is involved in change. Our scripture tells us the early stories of creation that chaos existed and God breathed, covered over those waters of chaos and brought order out of the chaos. And so I wonder about the chaos that we feel, the chaos that we feel and the changes that are happening how much of that is order happening out of chaos? Because I have seen some times and some places where that change is a really good thing, that that change has people stepping up where they may not have stepped up before, stepping up to do things outside of their comfort zones, do things that are a little bit more bold and daring, do things that so that people can know and understand God. And well, that's the end of my two minutes. So grace and peace to you. May you be blessed.